I forgot to land at Reckless Railways. This game was about two hours after the previous one. I had to go do something and I completely forgot that I had to do this rule. So when I came back, I unfortunately forgot that I had to land at Reckless Railways. Um, to counteract this, because I did break my own rule that I made, give me some punishments that I have to do for the next video. video we finally hit elite which is amazing because that means we only have two more ranks until we hit unreal the bad news is that i forgot to do one of the promises that i made in that video which was to land at reckless railways for the following two games i only did it for one of them because i took a break in between my first and second game and i completely forgot i even had to do it so now i have to do some challenges that you guys came up with i am really not looking forward to this because we finally got into elite and the second we did we have to do punishments this is not good i am not that good at the game to be doing punishments in this high of a rank this is horrible i hope you guys know i'm probably gonna derank we are not hitting unreal because of this episode for the first challenge in the video we're gonna choose this one that says your punishment should be a one chest challenge i love this idea i then asked is floor loot allowed so i get one chest and the rest can be floor loot which unfortunately they didn't respond so we're gonna go with that hopefully we don't derank because of these punishments but we won't know until we start so let's hop into game one one chest challenge here we go where we land is crucial so we're gonna land in an unnamed spot this is important because if I can only get one chest, I don't want to be surrounded by a whole bunch of people. So hopefully this is a good spot. I don't know. Sometimes there's a lot of people that come here, but I guess we'll see. My plan is to go from that house down to this house. This house typically has a lot of floor loot. This area back here also has a lot of floor loot. Oh, this is not good. Someone's coming over here. We're going to go for the shotgun immediately. I haven't opened a chest yet, so we're fine. Oh my god, gold SMG. Oh wait, do these count as chests? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say no. I don't think they count as chests. Oh man, I take the high road and say they do count as chests. Ah, they're not glowing and they're not chest shaped. We're gonna say no, we're gonna say no. I don't think the vaults count as chests. I think that's fair. It also doesn't count as floor loot though. I don't know. For the sake of this video, we'll say it doesn't count. All right, let's go open our first chest. I should say our first and our last. Yeah, we didn't get much. Hey, we did get a big shield, though. All right, that was the only chest. For the rest of the game, we can't open another chest. That also means we can't break any of the hidden chests. Like, if this one had a chest in it, we can't break that. Did the car spawn over here? I don't think I saw it. Mm, it did not. Okay, that's fine. I really want a sniper, but I'm not sure if they can really spawn good ones on floor loot. Oh, man, this chest is just waiting. My spider senses are starting to tingle. Oh my god, I almost died. I don't think he looted everything though, right? Oh no, he did. Okay. Uh, can I recruit the bot that's up here very quickly because we have 25 seconds? Oh, what the hell? Get me out of this. How do I get out of this? So far, so good. I thought this challenge would be a little harder only because the loot, I feel like, got nerfed for this season. I'm not sure if I'm the only one that feels like that, but I've definitely been getting worse loot from chests. Sometimes I get lucky, but overall, I get pretty bad loot. Maybe it's just my luck. Oh, I also can't run over chests to open them. That still constitutes as opening a chest. Oh, I'm dead. I couldn't get out of the car, dude. That was so stupid. I don't know why I did that. For this next game, we're gonna do a one gun challenge. I'm gonna choose to do an SMG only challenge, only because I feel like out of every gun in the game, I very rarely use the SMG, so I'm not gonna be used to it, and I'm already not good with it. So to make it even harder on myself, we're gonna use the SMG. Actually, I think throughout this entire series, I don't even think I have an SMG kill under my belt, which if you think about it, is kind of impressive. I've gone this entire time without even getting an SMG kill. We're landing here only because I know the vault usually drops an smg so hopefully we'll get a little lucky and get a good one but we'll see there's someone landing on top of the mountain they're probably gonna see me all right let's land here then see this is really bad now because i need to find an smg somehow i think this is the hardest part of any one gun challenge it's actually finding the gun maybe if we drive through pleasant we'll see one just on the ground somewhere there's a loot llama that is not an smg there's a chest please give me an smg that is not an smg this is not going good uh, that counts. The burst SMG definitely counts. I will take it. At least it's a gun. Oh, okay. There we go. Grapple? Okay, that's actually perfect. So now we can get close range to people. For this challenge, I'm also not going to recruit the bot, mainly because I feel like that's cheating. That is not a one gun challenge. That's a one gun and whatever the bot has gun challenge. I don't want to bush camp this game, but I also don't really know how to get kills with an SMG. Obviously, I know it's not good long range, and I do have a grapple so I can get close to them, but I'm also not good close range, so I don't know how to get kills with the SMG. Maybe we'll go on top of the mountain and try to camp it out, wait for someone to push us. That's probably the best plan that I have right now. Do either of my guns have scopes? 
Oh, that's not good. Dude, my aim sucks. Oh, there's someone down there. Should I start shooting at them with the SMG? Oh, the bots are spawning up here. There might be more of an incentive to come up here. This is good. This is good. I mean, we're top 30, but we also haven't seen anyone. So we're not going to earn a lot of rank points for this. I only had three challenges set up for this video, so... Dude, we tagged him a little bit. <laughs> All right, you know what? Let's leave. This guy seems pretty good at the game. I would rather get a higher placement than more kills. I don't think I'm winning that fight, especially because I think his guns are better. He only hit me twice or something, and I lost so much health. There is a medallion up here. I don't think anyone's baiting out this medallion. I don't know if we want to be marked during a one-gun challenge. Probably isn't the best idea. Stop. Chill out. It's not that deep. I promise you. I only have one type of gun in my inventory right now. I promise you I don't want to fight this. Oh, my God. No. Please. Oh, my God. I'm so bad with the SMG. There was no way I was winning that fight. Oh, we gained no percent. Oh my god. We're gonna be picking this challenge, which says for the first game of your next video, you have to go into squads, Phil. Unfortunately, I didn't pick that one to be the first game challenge because I wanted to tweak that one a little bit. I feel like going into squad, Phil, isn't really much of a punishment, mainly because I can easily get carried by someone else. So instead, we're doing no fill squads. Am I gonna get my ass kicked? Yeah, probably. Is this video gonna be really short because of this? Yeah, probably. But we're gonna have a great time, everybody. We're gonna fucking jump right in. Oh my my god why am i doing this i'm probably gonna derank so much i'm gonna get such an early exit thank you for commenting this because otherwise i would not have even thought about doing this so congratulations this might be the reason why i derank <laughs> let's get fucking pumped turn on the heavy metal music everybody lock the fuck in and let's do this shit there's 90 people that means there's 90 kills available for me i'll be surprised if i can even get two <laughs> we got no restrictions on this game that means we can get any chest we can get any gun we can play however we like we just got to make sure we don't place bad or we're gonna lose so much rank. No one came here, which is really good news. We could at least loot up in safety. I think this would be way more manageable in build mode because I feel so unsafe running around. I have zero cover and there are four possible people that I would have to kill. I do really need a sniper though. It's the gun that I'm best with. It'll at least give me some sort of advantage. All right, let's recruit the bot as well. Fucking bitch. All right, let's not recruit the bot. Let's try to hover around the edge of the circle. Oh, there's people to my left. We're gonna bait our car. There's people fighting somewhere over here. I think they're in this house or castle or whatever the fuck this is. There's people fighting on top of the mountain too. Fuck, I really need that car, but there's someone over there. Oh my God, we're gonna take the long way. Oh my God, of course there's people. Oh, I'm fucked. Oh, I'm so fucked. Yeah, fuck. What was I supposed to do, man? There's four of them. How much did I lose for that, though? Does no fill make me lose less? Oh, we only lost 3%. Okay, that's not bad. For our last game, I decided to not do a challenge so I could recover whatever I lost doing these challenges. However, we didn't lose that much, but I also don't have a challenge planned. So we're just gonna play this game like normal. This is kind of a bad drop for, like, any place, but I guess we'll go here. Seems like there's one other person landing here. That's fine. We'll go over here. I want a good placement this game because we only loaded in with 77 people. So if I place bad, I'm probably gonna lose a lot more rank points. Oh my god, we got a rocket launcher out of the mythic chest. What the fuck? Oh, we got a blue scar though. Let's swing by the gas station, see if anyone's over there. I'm gonna destroy this bush because I'm pretty sure there's someone in it. Never mind, I guessed wrong. I could have sworn I saw someone camping in it. Now I just look like a fucking doofus. Ah, oh, shit, we're kind of low on gas. And they took the car that usually sits here. Fuck, this is not good. Uh, there's usually cars in Fatal. I guess we can go there. Okay, we got a free medallion. That's very nice. Thank you to whoever did not pick up their loot after killing the medallion. You are an amazing human being. Okay, Kevin spawned basically in the middle of the map. I don't see anyone up there, but I also don't want to go up there. There's only 15 people left, which is sick, but I also have zero kills, which is not good. Ooh, the new circle is pretty buns. Does this car have more gas in it? 
It does. All right, let's go to circle. I'm gonna take the long way to get to circle to avoid going through Kevin. I think there's like two or three people up there and I am not trying to get involved with that. This game has gone by pretty quick. I mean, there was only 77 people, so it was kind of bound to go quick. Let's go over the bridge only because I want the far side of circle. I don't want the crazy side with Reckless and Kevin. So we're gonna try and go around. Oh, there's a medallion up here. Let's go back. God damn it, the medallion's up here. <gasps> no, you fucking bitch. No. Oh my god. Why did I not check that bush? Why did I not have my shotgun out? He's an unreal player. Oh my god. Well, I think that's a good place to end it. I hope you guys got your enjoyment at seeing me fail at a lot of punishments that you guys made for me. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.